Next step is going to be to fill it up and burp the radiator. What you need to do in order for that to work is have the cap be the highest point on the system and you just get the engine up to temp and open it, let it bubble out, keep adding it as you need to. And you jack the front of your vehicle up because the heater core is right around here on the passenger side, which is roughly level with the cap. So you need to get the cap above that. That helps a lot with getting the air out of the system, having the cap be the highest part. Yeah. Alright, so in addition to that little bit, I'm also parked on a hill, I don't know if y'all can tell. Make sure that the pet cock is tightly closed. Alright, you can get all kinds of safety funnels and whatnot, but if you're... I just open a big hole pointing this way, and a little hole pointing this way, and I have yet to spill anything. See it level with the top. Now squeeze the upper hose and it should force a little bit of air out. Yep, look at that. See, now I gotta add again. All right, so next thing we're going to do is we're going to turn on the truck and then and then turn the heat all the way up with the fan on one, wherever you want it. And um, that actually gets all the coolant circulating through the entire system, so it pushes all the bubbles out. So then you just leave it running, idling with the heat high, and you top it off some more while you squeeze the hose. I'm telling you that now in case you can't hear me. Turn off the engine so you can hear me say something, but you don't want to stop before your upper hose gets warm because if you stop before then, it means that the thermostat hasn't released yet and therefore you haven't circulated the entire system. Not all the bubbles are out yet. So turn that off to set real quick. I think we're going to start again. Alright, none of that looks like air. I think that's just a radiator bouncing. I think we're done. So it's all done. So see, it's full. So got the V6 radiator in, burped, full of fluid. Got the drilled out thermostat, flex fan. This thing should have a hard time overheating now. Pretty stoked about this. Um, I will link the other videos in this description for anyone who wants to see them. Thanks for watching.